you might say it's been a transformative year for Hollywood when a movie like Transformers Revenge of the Fallen took in $402 million at the domestic box office. I fell in love. <laughs> and the current hit, Avatar, is headed for the $300 million mark domestically after a little more than two weeks in theaters. One for Avatar to live in 10, please. It's been an incredible year at the box office in 2009. Enjoy. We're going to wind up with about $10.6 billion in revenue and the highest attendance in five years. So what about 2010? People in the movie game are trying to figure out how to top 2009's box office numbers. A hard act to follow. we got to hope. We're out there every week just hoping we hit it out of the park. And the formula for hitting it out of the park is sequel. To peace. 2010 will bring the second Iron Man movie. Sometimes you just have to get away with the girls. Carrie and her friends are back for another installment of Sex in the City. I am the chosen one. And the Harry Potter franchise will take moviegoers to Hogwarts for the seventh time. The secret is sequels sell. Audiences love the familiar, and they love to go back to the movies over and over again. And action! So don't be surprised if director James Cameron and his studio, Fox, announce in 2010 that an Avatar 2 is in the works. You are not in Kansas anymore. You are on Pandora. And at a time when the recession has people cutting back on things like expensive vacations and fancy meals... I am in so much pain right now. Going to the movies remains a relatively inexpensive alternative. George Lewis, NBC News, Hollywood.